हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू क्रिएटिव मेडिसिन इन दिस लेक्चर वी विल लर्न अबाउट then the next drug is procainamide this procainamide also belongs to class 1a and this procainamide is a short acting drug it is a pro drug and this procainamide will undergo acetylation and it results in formation of n acetyl pro cainamide will occur this n acetyl procainamide will cause will is responsible for the pharmacological action now this n acetyl procainamide also has it can cause tors the side effect one of the side effect of this is it can cause torsets d pointers can occur then then this procainamide also has an alpha blocking action that is it is a ganglion blocker it undergoes acetylation and thus it causes one more side effect is it can cause drug induced uh, sle can occur and especially this occurs whenever the patient is slow acetylator so this slow acetylator is has pharmacogenomic uh, interactions are seen that is the acetylers are of two types slow acetylers and fast acetylers due to the different gene Mm, and because of the differences in the gene, so the pharmacogenetic mechanism is in slow acetylers. There is drug induced SLE is seen in them, and this uh, uh, procainamide can be used in Wolff Parkinson's White syndrome. And this procainamide is also a second or third line choice. third choice for treatment of ventricular arrhythmias it is used for the treatment of sustained ventricular sorry sustained ventricular arrhythmias it is used in the treatment of sustained ventricular arrhythmias with acute mi in this case we can use this procainamide thank you and thank you for watching